Hey y'all, it's been one of those weeks. Sometimes you're the hammer, sometimes you're the nail. Well, this week it was a bit of both. So we'll give it to you. This is the Coffee Talk, our weekly roundup. So that's coming up. Okay, y'all, so today's a bit of a walk and talk because it's nice enough to be outside. So, yeah. Um, we started out the week, we had some decent weather, got the delivery of some of the equipment and was able to get some stuff done. And I even got to work on some of the electrical in this lower barn right here, that brown door you see behind me. And then Rachel was over here and on the top of this ridge right here, you can't really see it, is her pumpkin and what else? Pumpkins, cucumbers, and watermelon. Pumpkin, cucumber, watermelon. So the idea is she put it on that bank so it can run down the bank and kind of give a place for the vines to grow. And not take up room in my garden. Yeah. So... Come look at some of these flowers. Look at this. Come we here. have, spring has sprung and the flowers have been going crazy. So we have these right here. I'm going to flip you around. Aren't they so pretty? You can see, we got these. They're so bright. And then. The trees are all in bloom. So the pear tree. He's already bloomed. Already bloomed. The cherries already bloomed. The cherries, which was right there, has already bloomed. But as you can see, the, apple the apples. Yeah, look at this one over here behind the pear. Are now in full bloom. That one's just gorgeous. And the apples look great. Yeah. So we should have plenty of apples this year. Make some Keller feats. Flip you around again. But so we're expecting more equipment this week. And we got the doggies with us. I don't know. Where, where is she? There's Penny. And Denver's back there. Yep. So. Our happy idiot. Yep. Uh, more, more equipment's supposed to show up. We got, we're ordering more equipment. It's the nature of the beast. Um, we are moving towards basic, uh, basically, uh, I, I guess you could say well, like off-gridding. I, I mean, we're, we're doing all our own stuff. Um, so I've been working with the firewood and that was one of the pieces of equipment that came in to handle the firewood. And there's video content of that that I've been doing as I go along. So I will be putting something together for that for you guys. So flip them around and show them how my burn hill has um, turned back into grass. Yeah, uh, maybe a month or two ago we did the burning. I burnt the grass off. And, and this is the bank yeah. that, that we burned all, all the tall grass off of. Yeah. And that's the rubble pile from the, and then, uh, you know, this is where she burned all that stuff down. Doesn't hurt it at all. But anyway, so like I said, we're getting more equipment and the plumber is, has, has the, the, the parts and is looking at, um, June, he wants to start soon. But we're, to be honest, I thought he said June. To be honest, we're not we're not one hundred percent ready. Um, I still have to cut a square hole in one of the walls, and I'm waiting on a piece of equipment as well. So the plan in all that uh, is to get the equipment so that we can do one hundred percent of the work. And look at these flowers, these purple flowers. And Rachel's Rachel's pointing out some purple flowers all in here uh the plan is to have the equipment so we can just start and go 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 but um youtube wise we are adding subscribers we are getting the watch time yeah um, we broke 330 so yep. thank you all very yep. very much which reminds us if you like our content and you enjoy watching us even if you only get a laugh out of us please hit that subscription oh. thumbs up Click the notification. Our puppy dog. All right, hold on. Has decided. Come on. 
we're this way. I had to whistle for Denver Dog. It's a lot of work for our old man. Our old man is 17, now 17. almost a solid 18. So that's why we're not going too fast. We did lose him. And he doesn't hear so well and he doesn't see so well. Yeah. He gets lost easy, even in the house. But we're working on getting up and around to our, the back, the back 40. So anyway, as we were, as we were saying, sorry to digress, but if you do like the content and everything, like Rachel was saying, go ahead, click that like, click, click that subscribe. And uh, yeah. Hit the notification bell so that it always chimes you whenever we have something new up. But, uh, so what we got done, a lot of firewood yeah. um, and some electrical work. What we're gonna get done, more firewood and more electrical. So I should have the leg of the electrical to the lower barn finished. That'll be his part three Yep. in that series. And then it should be all done. But if you look up on the hill behind me, all the firewood is gone. I'll show you what I did with it in another video. But I think that's it for this week. Just a quick little update as to what's going on, um, what we got done, where we're going. This next week we should be finishing the wood stanchions over at our friend's house. Yeah, so the firewood storage over that we've been doing at the other homestead. Yeah, we have, um, we have the last that. pieces of that. And with the mixed bag of weather that we're having this week, I'll be in the, the workshop. Um, I was in the workshop all day today and really got nowhere. Um, today was his uh, nail day. Yeah, so I have an old BMW that's my commuting car. And, well, the alternator went, and the alternator actually shorted out internally, so it made the car stop working, period, dot. Not just battery not charging. So I had to change the alternator, and I did that. Spent all morning doing it. Then he went to change his and tires. And then I have to do tires, and I have to do stuff like that because it's due inspection, and the tires, while they're not bad, they're close, and I don't want any issues. And plus, once the tires start getting close, you get flats and stuff like that. So, well, I found out that the subframe on this car is pretty much Swiss cheese. Yeah. So... Now that it has a good alternator, it's going to the junkyard because the time and money that I would have to spend to do this whole subframe, it's just, it's not worth it. So I'm in the market for a new car. Your dog's leaving us. And you know, that's, that's, that's the whole nail part of it. But you know, you win some, you lose some. And well, the, we chalked this up to, hey, I, I had a win the car runs. Alternator's good now. But the loss, it's a, it's a, it's a piece of junk with a good, great alternator now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, like I said, you win some, you lose some. And, you know, we're coming back up around the top of the garden now. Yeah, and this is my gooseberries. And it's doing great, my raspberries. And if you can see, the, the my grapes have leaves the coming grapes out. grapes just started popping leaves. Yep. And the potatoes are doing amazing. Potatoes are doing great. That's the whole potato bin right yep, there. Right here. The peas are hanging on. We had a cold snap and I was worried about it. We them. had a cold snap and ended up having to. Let me flip you around. It's easier for me to aim you guys. The peas are holding on. We you had, can see I have bright green coming in, so yeah. they're coming back. We had a whole cold snap here. About a where week. Came out and put we blankets had, on. We had springish weather like we do now. And we had a cold snap to where it was down below 30 degrees. And it wiped out corn. It wiped out all yeah, types of stuff. Yeah, here's my corn. So. But the strawberries, look, look at the strawberries. So the strawberries. The strawberries are doing amazing. You can see your strawberries are doing great. They got blossoms already. But. And my herb snail's doing good. Yep. So if you saw the video on the herb snail and, and all that. The herb snail is now filling up. Yep. So. Oregano. Oregano. Basil. 
lavender, rosemary. That was dill. Now I only have three pieces left. I guess the birds wiped me out. And that's chocolate mint. So, Herb Snell's coming along. And that solar system right there has generated over 100 kilowatts of energy already. So here's the... Uh, that's amazing, amazing. Get out of there. And then you got... This, this is where all the, vine, all the vine plants are. And then the cucumbers. So all the vines are here, and the idea is to let them run down the hill. But anyway, I'll lay down straw so they don't get all dirt burned. We're going to wrap this up. We made a little loop of the back 40. So uh, if you haven't yet, please like and subscribe. And you know my motto, if you're thinking about family, you're thinking about friends, give them the what's up or the what's up. You know you'd love to hear from them too. And until the next adventure. Off he designed. Cheers. Mm -hmm.